What's up, Hard Garbage Squad? Today we're back with another RTA video. If you guys don't know, click on the event page and you will see the event called the Legend Tournament. Basically, the Legend Tournament happens right after RTA closes. So the RTA date is posted for those who don't know when it's closing. So right here, January 4th, that's when you can assume that the arena will close for RTA. So I have a list here that will show you some of the cutoff points based off information from last season. I basically pulled the information off Reddit. There's a thread every season. This was the cutoff season. As you can see, G3 was 2536 as a cutoff. And you will see in my rank, I finished 2538 last season. I just made G3 as 290. So the here, again, as you can see, it's pretty accurate. So I'm aiming for G2 here, 2241, just to make it as safe and going off to this data, I've seen a few more matches and I'll be a safe G2 and get my, get my, um, get my things, get my skins for my Lagmaron and my Rakan. So I'm gonna play a few matches. Hopefully we can reach that threshold and call it a day and no more RTA ever again. So let's get into our match here. We have a, I think this is like the, the top 10 guy actually. This picture is, uh, there's a bunch of these pictures, and I can't tell the difference, but I mean, we got ragged on our first battle here. <laughs> Looking pretty solid here already. Ragged all, let's go. Leo, okay. So he picks the Leo, so I'm gonna opt for... I'm gonna opt for... I think I'll go for a one-shot comp here. So I have full will. So, I don't have Will on my Illusion, but if I can just find my Daphnis. Uh, wait, my Daphnis is back here. If I have my Daphnis here. So, my last pick will de vary depending on his pick here. I'm hoping he picks um, not Wind, so I can pick a Water Unit. Ooh, Woonsa. Hmm. Woonsa. I wasn't going to ban the Leo because I have Will, so that Woonsa is probably my ban here. I mean, his whole team counters Cleave. Okay, now it's not the ban anymore. I gotta go for the Triana kill or outspeed the Woonsa. I don't think I'm outspeeding the Woonsa, so I need to go for the Triana kill. So what is the Triana killer here? Hmm. I think picking Lucian is actually okay too, because I need a wind threat. And then I just ban the Wunsa. I mean, I in a perfect world, my Lucian should have been on Will, but it's not. So this could pose for a small problem for me. If I can I don't think I'm winning this. <laughs> Based off of his draft, it's pretty OP. I mean, this guy has like a super visa card and you got a free-to-play player. So, does not get the violent proc to kill him. So that's very good news for me. We pray this does not resist. Yes. Okay. This, my win, my wide win condition has been met, and then we just kill it because I think he cuts me because of ragdoll. So I'm gonna be safe and go for the kill here. You look right there. Josephine cuts my Lucian, so that was the right play here. Does he kill it here? Uh, I think he does. Oof. So here, I don't really have anything. I don't have no defense break, so this is going to be really tough for me. I need to go for, I think, the Ragdoll. Takes a turn before me. If I can just reset him. Like, I mean, <laughs> look at his draft. He gets one Von proc every turn. This is like, disgusting. <laughs> That is super disgusting. How do you even beat Von Von Proc every turn? <laughs> okay. Uh, I don't think this is this is winnable. Because I can't kill the Josephine. I mean, if I stun, Josephine gets a turn. If I don't kill him, he gets Torrent. So, like, here we go. He gets a turn here. He puts it on my Garo. Right. See, this is the problem here. <laughs> okay, I mean... I did everything I could have, and the game's like, nah. Your, your style of play is prohibited. You are not allowed to play this game that's come to us. All right, I mean, I'll take it. Can't be too angry losing to Ragdoll Wunsa. 
and one von proc every turn. So, and this is literally why RTA is trash. All right, so here we go. It's got a win team. So I'm thinking Racky here, because Ganymede. Okay. Still thinking of picking my, my Racky here, and I banned the Artemil. Surprise, first battle LD, second battle LD. Surprise, surprise. Um, Triana maybe, if he picks a Triana. Okay, I'm definitely picking the Racky here. 100% a Racky pick. And then I ban the R. I don't ban the RML, I think. I think I ban the Nagong. It's got like HP bead. Hmm. Definitely ban the Nagong here, I think. And then I pick a Raki. Can, this has HP lead for everyone, and I can't amp through the whole thing. But if I have double fire, I think it's I think it's a W. So, so maybe for next season, I have to pick, I have to re my Lucian for a will, just because like these, <laughs> these, uh, these anti-cleave comps are pretty powerful. Okay. What's he do here? Go for the Lucian or the, the, blue, the red ball? The red ball. Okay, that's fine with me. So I should be still able to go through and I, th I want to send the Artemil. I don't want to revenge my whole team. Just kidding. My team's hot garbage. So the Artemil should be dead here. In fact, his whole team is dead here. <laughs> okay, so he picked the wrong one. I, I, th I don't know if it was, he was on violent, but if he was on violent, he could have one-shot my, my Lucian, basically. So he revives the Arda. But I can just kill the Arda if I land a defense break here. There we go. Defense break has been... Condition has been met. And kill, and we're in a good spot. Cool. And two LD and F5s, then you're G1. So I think it's just a room quality thing for him. Or maybe he's just climbing up right now. Oof. So it looks like I need like three more battles, I think. Okay. Another G3 player. It's got a Chinese flag, so I'm gonna assume it's like a ragdoll last pick. Show me the ragdoll. Oh, no, he's pretty free to play here, it seems like. So, he's got last pick. And I think I need a speed lead here. I'm pretty sure I need a speed lead here. This could be a swift verd. And if it's not a swift verd, I ban the verd and you have Vanessa Ethna. Ethnas are pretty high speeds, are built on pretty high speeds here. So, what's the ban? I think it's probably like this. I think it's like this. And then my, my Shimate goes through. So what I'm gonna do is use Shimate's third skill on the Fran and get a Garo to prop the second skill with um, a train out passive. So I'm hoping he's a little bit on the squishier side. So let's see if he has any will runes, first of all. So he's got no will runes. And his Fran doesn't cut me. So I'm actually gonna assume he's actually really squishy here. This could be, I think this is, there's two ways to, pl to play it here. Defense break and kill a Triana or go for the, the kill right here. With the second skill. Nope, so I didn't have enough damage. So my Shimate didn't have enough damage after triggering his passive, but he has nothing left here. He has no more heals, so I can one shot something here. My Garo can one shot one unit. Ooh, that's a lot of damage he's got there. Okay. So, let's go for here. He has one heal here. So, the Raki. It's a swift Raki, I think. Yeah, it's a pretty much a, it's a swift Raki. So, this is, like a, this is another type of cleave he's got here. So, maybe I should run the defense break and kill his whole team. So, maybe I misplayed that. I think the Verd is the play here, because he's turn cycling on me. I don't think the Raki has potential to solo me here, so I didn't kill it. Proc? 
Okay, and I think that's I think that's GG. There's no way he gets me. That, that Draco proc was very very clutch. He has like a super high speed team here. Okay, he should have the skills from his Triana. So that's got pro second skill. I have it up. I'm just, I think it is, this is like no, there's no way I'll lose this. So it doesn't really matter how much I play, how how bad I play this. So Triana passes is, is up, and I have second skill from Garo. Hopefully, I can trigger it right here, right here, and that is GG. So, uh, okay, is this gonna vine proc on me? The crit damage Triana gonna vine proc on me? <laughs> no, I think there's I think there's two ways I could have played that. If I was looking at a replay, I could have defense broken it, but I would have a guaranteed loss if he revenge proc to me. 100% lose if he revenge procs on the verb. So that was the riskier. Like, if, it, if it was revenge, then it's risky. But look at how squishy his team was. My Shimate second skill with defense break would have just sh shredded his whole team there. Okay, so it looks like he's going for a cleave comp. So let's see what his cleave comp is. In today's meta, taking Vanessa first pick is really valuable. Okay, it's not a cleave comp. He's got, <laughs> he's got a ragdoll comp. So this guy picks cleave units, but he just picks a ragdoll in the end to trick you. I got it. Makes sense. So, the thing what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pick the Juno to strip his buffs, and I need some sort of threat. Some sort of threat here. If I pick the Daphnis, I'm too fire heavy. So I think I'll pick the the Aegir actually. The double one shot comp. Okay, I mean, pretty pay to win. So I don't think he's able to one shot my whole team here. But the Diana doesn't work really well with the Ragdoll. But I need to live somehow. So if I just pick a Tyrannus. And then the Odin has their ignore all the time. So if I can just kill the, the Oberon, I think I'll be okay. So the Oberon has got to one shot my, my Triana. I think he can. He's got, he has got the buff. So, I mean, I think three matches here, I play against really heavy LD users. So, so let's take his attack buff here. I'm gonna take his attack bar. And then Ragdoll passive puts him up. And then, and then he, he shakes, I put him before. So let's see what he does here. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Are you kidding me? I didn't get anything. <laughs> wow, that's ridiculous. So I think this is a lose. Not getting anything there was super, super bad. Like, beyond terrible here. Okay. Potential, I got Ivan proc. I think I'll go for the Oberon. That made a difference. He's got, like, I wanted to go for Oberon so he can't ventilate. So this is my this is the threat here. He can one shot my next unit. I need to kill him off. Even if he ventilates, it's only if a step buff and then he gets his gauge back. Does he ventilate or go for the kill? Goes for the no kill here. So that's really big for me. So now my Vanessa. It's got revive. So what do I do here? Go for the stun. 
Go for the vine proc. Yes. But go for the vine proc with the dot. No dot. No dot. The, he goes for the third skill. He has, he's got third skill, I believe. Next turn. Next turn? Next turn he's got third skill. Okay. <sighs> okay. Please just do something. Ooh, that is huge. Okay. I have glancing on. So let's try to get, get a. Okay. The Oberon dies, 100%. I got glancing. I don't, I don't think I can stick any buffs here if I have glancing. Fuck, whatever. Got it. Okay. This is huge. This is huge. This is huge comeback potential here. He's got. He doesn't have third skill. Next turn he has third skill, I believe. Okay. Juno kills me up, but uh, heal block on my Aegir. All right. This is a W, boys. All right. We managed. Man, I should beat him with one clutch volume prop from the Aegir, and the Juno did. Absolutely nothing. Okay, this guy's hard garbage. Hey, I reached two two four one. Hey, look, I, I reached. That's, that's a cutoff. So I need to reach a little bit higher than the cutoff from last season. Okay, it's him again. All right, cool. So I know what he's drafting now. So what I can do is play the same style, knowing he's got, knowing he's got a bunch of. Kill units. So he's speaking the same stuff again. But he didn't account for this, did he? Will the Miho work? It should work. I feel like it should work. Like, at least this time, like at least this time, my Juno will not miss everything, maybe? Okay. Let's see what he does here. Full team buff. And then Oberon one-shots something. And then I go, I go before. I don't go before him because I was on Nemesis too. He's got double attack bar increase. Okay, that is very bad for me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> How do I miss the Oberon? How does the hundred resistance Oberon? Swear to God. Holy crap! So unlucky. Like, if I just manage to get some form of dot on him. Oh, man. Okay, I need to kill this ragdoll. But I got glancing on me. Okay, no. Now he cleanses everything. And I think I'll lose here. Juno's hot garbage. Can't even kill that. So this is like a Miho, Miho solo maybe. I need, I need Miho to do mad work here. She's got to do mad insane work. Okay, please send the Oberon. Like this one time come to us. But how does he resist everything? Three times! What the f is that? Okay, he's got a crit, right? Like, he has to crit here. Crit! Oh, he's got second skill. Damn. That was my win. Like, the Juno strip was the win condition. If I was P 
he didn't have all those buffs, if they didn't have the immunity, I could have controlled his attack bar last round. Very, very unfortunate. <sighs> Three times Juno didn't do crap. And this is the Juno, by the way. Like, this is the Juno. It has accuracy. There's no way Obron's built 100, 100 accuracy. Okay, another Ragdoll user. Okay, I love this game. Another Artemil user. I love this game. I love Comp to Us. Okay, so I'm picking Illusion, obviously, here. The last pick here is I'm deciding on. Last pick. Last pick. So what do I do here? Do I ban the Druid actually? I think the Druid is the ban. I am I am unwilling to give the Druid. I am unwilling to give the Druid a defense buff on the Iron Mill. I'd be lying. Let's see if I wasn't tilted. This is a. <sighs> There's a lot of LDs. So I'm gonna go for the attack buff here. Honestly, I think I might get cut. But that triggered Trion Pass. Okay, that was a lot of damage. I mean, I didn't mean to trigger Trion a passive here. But hopefully I can kill this Daphne still. <laughs> oh, this is this is not good. It's a little bit greedy. I should went for the Triana. I'm definitely a little bit greedy here. Okay, <laughs> okay. Come to us gave me a paycheck for a W here. Oh my god. That's my win. 100% that's my win right here. Oh, that was amazing. Okay, get this garbage out of here. Get you out of here. And... Oh, wow. Thank you, thank you, Arwen Jesus. I got a stun here. Should be okay. So am I above two two four one yet? Oh, okay, I'm two. I'm two points above the cutoff, just like last season. So let's call it a day. Like that's too many ragdoll users. Thanks, guys. Make sure you like, subscribe, and comment. And to be honest with you, in probably next two seasons, Cleve might be dead because how Com Twist balances their game. So peace.